what's happening YouTube? Welcome back to Sense of South Jersey with me, Kellen, for a fragrance review today. Um, I wanted to do a first impressions video. I haven't really done one of those in a long time and I thought it would be fun to do one. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna test out this fragrance and I'll you know talk about it a little bit and then I'm gonna come back in a couple hours after it dries down and I've worn it and I'll give you my first full wearings impression and opinion. So this is actually from a small house. It's called um, Authenticity Perfumes, LLC. And they happened to add me on Instagram, followed me, and I, I looked at the page, followed back, and I was scrolling through it and actually reached out and I was told that you can get a sample. Um, so I navigated through their page and found out their website and bought a sample. And it looks like they're, again, a small house. They have three scents. Um, the one that I have is called Barbershop. And I was fortunate enough, finally, after months of not getting a haircut, my barber actually came and gave me a haircut at my house. So. Thank you, Nick, to coming over. I really appreciate that. Um, but this fragrance house actually has three scents. Like I mentioned, they have one called Authenticity. The next one is Barbershop. And their third scent that I can see so far on their page is called Lone Riche. But I was most interested in Barbershop. So I got the sample here, really cool sample bottle because it has a sprayer. It's not like just a dabber or anything like that. Um, and the notes for this fragrance from what I've read are top notes of bergamot and lemon, the middle has sweet basil, fir, and oak moss, and the base is patchouli, cedarwood, and musk. So right off the bat, those sound like right up my alley. And when I had read that, I was like, oh, I gotta try this one. And I always have loved fougeres, always have loved barbershop scents. And um, you know, this one seems like it's gonna be a fresh one. They have a really cool looking bottle. I think it's a 60 ml bottle and it is on sale now for $29.99 so you can get it off their website. Um, probably a great last thing. It's all um, a parfum concentration. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and spray some on my hand here. We'll see. Let's give it another one there. Wow, wow, look at how shiny that is. You can really see, I don't know if you can see in the camera, but that's, yeah, there you can see the gleam on that. This is really, really strong concentration, so. Wow, right away I'm getting the fur and the lemon. That's the first two things I smell. And maybe a little bit of the basil, but the bergamot, the lemon, and the fur. Wow, that's really strong. Really masculine and very, very, very fresh. I really like that. I bet this lasts a long time. And, and, and these are scents that I think are quintessential barbershop notes. Some barbershop fragrances, there's fougere fragrances that I think some lean more toward citrus, some lean more of like a musky scent. Some are, are just, you know, better suited to be more of a cool weather. This to me, right off the bat, citrus, I get a lot of the, um, a lot of the warm weather notes too. So what I'll do is I'm gonna you know, come back in a little bit and then from there I will tell you guys about how it performs, see what I get on the dry down, and, um, and I'll give it my overall review for my first wearing. Again, not a full review, this is just the first impressions. So be back in a little bit. Hey guys, um, again, welcome back. This is the second half of the day here. Um, I've worn Barbershop by Authenticity perfumes for probably about three hours now. Just been kind of hanging around my house. Obviously still not much you can do, not much places you can go um, due to the shutdown, but the scent has really performed. Um, it's pretty strong, girlfriend really liked it. I now I'm getting, and you can still see a still like an oil spot on my, on my hand there from like the high concentration of that fragrance too. So this is absolutely quality stuff. Now I really get the cedar wood like that strong cedar wood scent, like you just opened a fresh cedar wood drawer and you get hit with that and a little bit of the musk now too. So it almost is drying down to a little bit of a vanilla scent too, like there's talk in there, but I know that's not listed, but I'm, so I'm getting a little bit of that. Um, but anyway, you know, I haven't given this a 12 hour performance, but you can tell it's gonna perform really well. Um, it's still strong projection and this is hour three. So this is really cool. This is definitely something I would like to get a bottle of for sure. Again, it's $29.99 if you want a fresh masculine keyword there too, because it's not like it's, you know, super mall fragrance or anything like that. Like this is a masculine man's barbershop scent. Like this is something I would want a barber to spray and then after they're done, hit you in the back of the neck and you walk out, you smell fresh. That is the type of fragrance that this is. Um, the lemon, it's strong. All the notes are projecting really well and have projected really well as the fragrance cycle has gone on. I haven't had worn it for 12 hours, but there's no doubt that it would last that long. 
Um, this is definitely one I want to buy. I I'm not sure about the other ones. I haven't tried it, but but this one stood out. And if you take a look at the bottle, and I'll put a picture of the bottle, uh, you know, now in this video, like they got the cool looking, just the blue, white, red barbershop, like old school, classic American barbershop. Um, that spinning pole in there, and that's a really cool bottle. I actually really like that, even though it's probably just the sticker. I haven't held it. Um, and if I'm wrong, I apologize if it's not, if it's some sort of painted on thing on the bottle, but I would imagine it'd be a sticker. That's a cool look. I've always thought that was an attractive presentation. And I think Fougere fragrances, again, are, are, are some of my favorites. Those are the things that prompted me to even start this channel way back when I did like over a year ago, um, you know, when I first tried Aqua de Parma and was just blown away by that. And, and to me, that's like, in my opinion, one of the ultimate barbershop scents. And this is like a stronger, um, more pronounced version of that a little bit, you know, cause they have the citruses and the musk and it's not the same fragrance at all, but um, in terms of if it's like this one that's staying power, this one that really has it. Um, I would like to try some of their other fragrances. I'm sure they're quality, but this one is awesome. And for um, $29.99, this probably would last. You probably only need one, two sprays max of this. I would spray it on my wrist and maybe kind of rub some on my neck because of you know the strong concentration. It's not a eau de toilette. It's, it's, it's a straight parfum. And again, the, the oil, I am still blown away by that. You might not be able to see it now. But um, anyway, I really like this one. I want to check it out. So Authenticity Perfumes, LLC, check them out. Barbershop, it's a pretty cool scent. I'm enjoying this one and I'm going to use this sample and probably when this is done, I would be interested in buying a bottle. Again, it's like 30 bucks, I think. So not bad, high quality stuff, probably worth it for sure. So um, again, thanks for watching this video. If you guys know about this fragrance house, please let me know if you know of any other ones. I would have guessed that they're relatively new. And uh, if not, check them out. Check them out on Instagram. That's where I, they, they found me and then I, uh, I, I looked through their page um, and I'm happy to do a review on this one too. And I get the bottle eventually, I'll probably do a full review you know, again, presentation, you know, no breakdown again, you know, a couple, couple days wearing in a row uh, in terms of, you know, performance experience and then my thoughts. But right now I'm really liking it. It's uh, really enjoyable and I'm definitely getting the cedar wood. I'm still getting a little bit of vanilla vibe too, which um, is not my favorite thing in the world in terms of um, barbershop, but it's mixed in with the cedar and the musk and the citrus is so strong too. So, and I still get the top notes. So I, I'm really enjoying this one as well. So check them out. Uh, I really like it again, barbershop by Authenticity Perfumes, LLC. See you guys in the next video. Thanks so much.